Welcome to Around BI. This is first episode of our series of database management. In coming tutorials, we will go through database concepts, design methods and much more. Let's start with basic element of a database, data. We are living in a digital world and every day we discuss and talk about data. Data is present everywhere, all around us. It is a term that has become part of our life. If you ask me to define what is data, data is a detail, a value, a factual information that is associated with any object in consideration. And that object could be something concrete like a person, a building, a store, a bank account, a product, or it can be something very abstract like a business process. Let me explain. This is a hospital building. When we see this hospital building, what basic facts that we can infer? This building has five floors. Outside color is blue. It is an emergency department. Doctors working in the hospital, number of nursing units, number of rooms, number of beds are some other facts. And these are some data points for this building. If I take an example of a person, basic properties of a person could be his first name, his last name, his height and weight, his demographic information like his house number, city, state, country, zip code or other attributes that belong to him. These attributes collectively create data for this person. When we go to bank to withdraw money, cashier asks for account number. Here account number, account holder name and amount in the account are some obvious data points. You pick any object and we will get some data for that object. Let's move to find some data characteristics. If you look closely at these examples, all this factual information falls under two categories, qualitative data and quantitative data. Qualitative data that is textual in nature, I mean word or text based. For example, for a person, his first name, his address are text values. For hospital, hospital department that is emergency department, building color are examples of text data. Other type of data is quantitative data that is numeric data which can be calculated and computed. It is expressed in numbers. In bank account example, amount is a number and it represents quantitative data. We go to a retail store and purchase 10 items. Here number of purchased items, their price value, any possible tax on sales price are numbers. In today's world, data is not limited to text and numeric value. A picture, image, files like PDF, sound clips, videos are also considered data. But the scope of our tutorial is limited to only text and numeric data. This is about what is data, but what do we do with data? With every object, every process, we have related data. So what is purpose of generating and storing this huge amount of data? We gather data to do analysis on them. We do some kind of calculation or reasoning on collected data. And that analysis brings information out from the given data set. Data is very important aspect for business. It is affecting the way we do analysis, we do business. Data analysts and business stakeholders rely on data to produce trends, insights and pattern about business. We have lot of data around us and to get information from that data, we need to store it somewhere. We store data to a database that is a collection of related data. It's another story. In next tutorial, we will understand database and different ways to store and access information from a database. Please share your feedback and comments with us. Thanks for watching.